I keep hearing about this subnetting thing in networking, but I don't really get it. Hey, Nikki, I can explain that. But first, let's recap something. Do you remember how IPv4 addresses are represented? Of course I do. They are 32-bit numbers divided into four octets, each separated by a dot. Spot on, Nikki. So subnetting is a way to divide a larger network into smaller subnetworks by borrowing bits from the host part of the IP address to create the subnet address. All right, I'm with you. For example, this subnet mask right here means that the first 24 bits are for the network and the remaining eight bits are for the host. That sounds cool, but why 24? Well, let's convert that to binary. Notice how we have 24 ones followed by eight zeros. The ones indicate the network portion and the zeros that follow are the host portion. Another simpler way to represent this subnet mask is as slash 24. Okay, let's see if I understand. So I have this IP address and a slash 28 subnet mask. This means I have 28 bits for the network part and the four remaining are for the host part, right? That's right. Let's represent this IP address and subnet mask in the binary form. We can find the network address by performing a bitwise AND operation between them. Then, if we invert the subnet mask and perform a bitwise OR operation, we find the broadcast address. All addresses in between are our usable IP addresses. Ah, it all makes sense now. Thank you, Kim.